Well, hello and welcome to another edition of TBK Eats. So this afternoon, Ericsson and I are having afternoon tea at Bijou, which is the patisserie at the Sofitel uh, Obelisk. Why is it called Obelisk? Look behind me, because there's a big obelisk outside. And this was uh, one of Dubai's newest hotels a couple of years ago. Uh, very highly recommended. I came here back in December and was upstairs in the French uh, bistro just before Christmas. And later on, I'm going to be coming to have a roast Sunday lunch uh, in the uh, English uh, gastro pub uh, called Nine. Uh, I just need to find someone to come and have Sunday lunch who's not working on a Sunday. And um, or I'll come on my own. Just one Sunday left now before I go back to Bahrain. So we have a full afternoon tea ordered and um, we'll talk you through it as it arrives. Okay. Yeah. What's in the box? Okay. <gasps> this is savory. Sandwich. Oh. <laughs> you know what this is? You know what they call this in Tagalog? Which one? Yes. Oh. <laughs> so we're working our way through our little box of delights here and we've had the Monsieur, which was beautiful. I just had a croissant, which had some guacamole inside it. And now I have some uh, beautiful uh, French bread with some uh, tomato and uh, cheese on. And then we have some goat cheese just here with some uh, very finely cut bread, which goes in here like this. And then we have a little quiche to eat. All oh, beautifully made, very, very tasty. So Ericsson is struggling with the same problem that I just had, which is the fact that there's a lot of cream inside some of these dishes. And it's two pieces of pastry, and when you squeeze them together, the cream all comes out the bottom. I've already got it down my uh, round mm -hmm. shirt that I went and bought to come out for today. Uh, but, you know, we're doing our hardest. We've closed the top drawer now, and we're on the second but I decided to cheat and went down to the third drawer and had a chocolate eclair. Um, I've also sent an uh, email to my good friend Mr. Comor Foucault in uh, Bangkok, sending him pictures of the nice food and telling him that we're back in this beautiful French hotel. Sadly he's on holiday so he didn't get the email, um, but he'll get it when he comes back to work. I was telling him how difficult it is being retired and having to whirl away the days in beautiful hotels like so to tell obelisk and um, eat afternoon tea with um, a great tea and water and cakes. So, Ericsson, what should we have next? Next plan? No, next cake. You choose. Uh -huh. I think uh, I'm gonna get, because you ate your tart already. I had my tart, yes. Yeah. I think it's better for you to try the pistachio before you go to the chocolate and vanilla. Okay, which one's the pistachio? In the middle. At the back? Or this one? This one, yeah. This is pistachio? Yes. Looks like a flower to me. And of course, we have another cup of Earl Grey tea. Let me get my finger ready. Here we go. And I was showing Chester, I love this. In my teapot, there's a little teacup. And on the little chain for the teacup is the tea. No tea bags here. Real tea. Lovely. And of course, to wash it all down, some good old San Pellegrino. Cheers, everyone. So we're starting off with the croque monsieur, which is, of course, cheese, a jambon, as they say in French, or Ahoy, as they say in Tagalog, or pig. 
hand, as they say in English. And it tastes absolutely beautiful. And it's uh, nice and warm. We're having more uh, fresh tea made as we speak. And then we have to work our way through this beautiful little cabinet and then have a great uh, presentation of our key. Okay. The nice thing about these little cakes is they're quite small, so it's not like you're eating huge amounts of food, and you just have to pace yourself. It's like a Friday bunch in Bahrain. Just go slowly, go a race, take your time. However, the hotel does impose a one and a half hour time limit. You have to complete your tea within one and a half hours, so they can get more people in after. C'est la vie, as they say in France. Cheers.